We're on my mini account that I've had for seven years. And we're going to max it out by buying the entire shop. Everything's 8x, 12x value, but there's so many offers that adds up to just under $1,000. So this is what all of my cards look like. They're all about level 11. I think gold is a bottleneck. I have all level 14 champions. I wish I had a coin for that, but we don't. If you look at Royale API, I have about 60% progress, 83% on the champions because I used Book of Books before it was patched up. We still need 16 million gold to max out. Here's the catch. I'm going to buy everything, all the evolutions, except for the mortar, because I don't hate money that much, because I already have the evolution mortar. And then these hero deals are just awful. I already have my heroes maxed out. I don't need it. I only need the little prince. I'm only going to buy cards I actually need. They shouldn't have even served me these cards because they're maxed out. Well, Minus the elite wild cards, but first things first, since I'm spending so much, I'm going to use code OJ. If you buy any of these deals, I appreciate it. It supports the channel. The question is, do I have book of books to fuel my little prince rampage? That's 11 of them. How far does that get? I hate how you have to go there and then click twice. So that's level 12. Level 13. I have three wild cards. Oh, look at that. We're level 48. We would need 19 little princes. That's not even worth it. I do need this, but not the <sighs> golden knight or the my. <sighs> and wasn't this deal $100 a year ago for all the evolution shards? This one is actually good value. It's probably the only one that's worth it in the shop just because how Supercell gate kept all the shards. That's yeah, insane. They had three shards when they first released, and I, we all thought that was going to be the cadence of the shards. Holy, we're just unlocking evolutions back to back to back to back to back like that. That's satisfying. Still have the kingly offers. Jesus. And you can buy three of them? My wallet! At least this one gives elite wild cards. We, we do kind of need that. How far is $1,000 worth of 12x value going to get my account? I wonder if anyone else is buying the entire stacks. Is there someone out there buying every single deal out there like this account is? Probably not, because all the champion offers are just garbage. But if there is someone out there buying every offer in the entire shop, be sure to use code OJ. Wow, these offers suck. Okay, I'm going to buy one. It said evolution already unlocked and it still let me pay for it. I'm going to buy one just to see how many elite wild cards that's going to give me. Or wild common. It's already unlocked, okay. For 3,000 mortar cards. Hmm. You know it's bad when Supercell asks you to confirm. Okay, you know what? I actually kind of need these mortar cards, and then I want to see what happens if I have more than 3,000. It's going to give me elite. You know what? Why is, why is there spillage? We'll find out soon after I buy all the offers. Oh, God. All of these insane deals, but I still need 16 million gold to max out. Like, these wild cards, they mean nothing to me. <laughs> 66,000 elite wild cards. We're not going to make level 15 cost gold. We're just going to make it impossibly hard to obtain. So we're going to get at least... 8 elite wild cards. You know it's bad when it <laughs> maybe re-entered my credit card. And the only reason I even have 2 million gold is because of that chess morale glitch. Where they meant to give us 100 like 200k gold and they meant to give clash of clans 2 million gold but then they gave clash royale 2 million gold i think even though i didn't buy the champions that was still this much amount of money all right we definitely need to upgrade zap oh that converts into wild cards i like it and i'm just gonna dump everything into the evolutions Because that would be insane if you didn't. I just have way too many common cards. But I'm running low on gold. And I hate how you can't see gold on this menu. Alright, we have 1.6 million. And then we upgrade the firecracker. Oh, I almost forgot. We need the evolved ice spirit. They're, they're, if no one's using it, they're going to buff it, surely. Surely they're going to buff it. Also. The diamond pass is going to give us some sweet, sweet cards that we need. And gold. More importantly, the gold from the chest. But most importantly, the literal reason why I bought it was the Ice Spirit Evolution. 
I rarely play on this account anymore, but I played it for a year straight in the beginning. Oh, we're level 50. I don't think I want to really touch that yet. Oh, the packs didn't have Evolution Archers or Evolution RG. We got scammed. All right, I'm going a little too crazy on these. I might just do Mortar. Oh, for sure we're doing Skeletons. I love Evolution Skeletons. It's just so stupid, especially on a low trophy account. And Fireball. Yes. So most of my cards already were level 14. I just didn't have the gold for it. 50,000 wild cards. 56 legendary cards. I'm going to get all my cards to level 13. Are there any baby cards? Oh my god, level 9 skeleton dragons. All right. And I like how I'm sitting on a stack of 4,000 of them. I'm probably going to run out of gold soon and I don't even know it. Get the wizards up. Wait, I don't even play Path of Legends, so this doesn't even matter to me. Well, we still have 1 million gold. All right, we're good. Thought it was a lot less. I'm surprised there are no gold offers in the shop. Why are they gatekeeping gold now? These offers are so trash. It's so imbalanced. Last year, we got all gold and we didn't have enough cards. Now we have too many cards and not enough gold. So the moral of the story is you have to keep buying in the shop every year and keep playing. And no, they're not. They don't think like that. What's crazy is that Clash Royale is still more free to play than Clash Mini is. The battle machine can cost up to $560. That's insane to me. Like, it kind of makes sense because it's $500 to instantly unlock. There's no levels in Clash Mini. And by the way, I'm not trying to defend them. I'm trying to explain their rationalization. So it's the quote, because there's no levels, you instantly unlock it at full power. So imagine you spent $500 on a new card, but it was level 15. Not 14, level 15 elite level, right off the bat with evolution. Still kind of expensive, but I hope you see my point. <laughs> and just like that, we're out of cards. I mean gold, but I still have a lot of elite wild cards to dump stuff into. So we're going to do that. Pretty much everything that's level 13, I can instantly get to level 14 now. I just don't have the gold for it. So many elite wild cards. Is there like an add all button? <laughs> 40,000 common elite wild cards. I don't think I have, I need that many. Wow, 25,000 rares. I'm never using 25,000 rares. Am I? Is, is that enough? And then level that up. I might need to be a little bit more uh, sparing on the legendaries because there are new cards coming out in 2024. They mentioned that. They mentioned there's uh, going to be more evolutions. There's going to be a champion. Did they mention there's another card? I don't remember. 35, we still have 35,000 commons, 20,000 rares. I didn't realize we had that many rares. Literally everything is ready to level up. And we still have all these book of books. Wait, we don't have a book of book book, do we? For the little prince? Because that stuff is expensive. No, we don't. Really wish I had 75,000 gold right now. And I really wish I managed my books better. I forgot I had them. At least we have a book of legendary I can use later. I can't even apply all of my wild cards that I just got. I started with 2 million gold. And these are all the cards that we have that we can't even touch. We can still max out two elite wild things. Nope. There's nothing that interests me. Level 54. We're a higher king tower level? I wasn't max king tower? What? Oh, great. Level 15 princess needs elite wild cards? What? Okay, please tell me... That level up chest is going to give me elite 50,000 elite wild cards. I'm going to be pissed if it doesn't. There's no way Supercell is doing that. We have to open up our level 54 chest now. I was, I was going to save this for the cannon. Oh, one royal giant evolution. Yay. Thanks, Supercell. You're so generous. <laughs> There's not even enough elite wild. Yay. We have two. Here's the level 54 chest. 9,100 gold.
Okay, 50,000 princess cards. Wow, I wish I did that before the update. So it did give me 50,000 elite wild cards, which I could have spent on a different card, which would be weird, but yeah. We still have 32,000 commons, 13,000 rares, 2,600 epics, and all the books that I didn't use yet. Oh, this is okay value. Anything below 250 is not. Trust me, bro. I sort of did the math. Oh, I'm getting a Mega Knight up. <laughs> and then we're going to use the Book of Books on him. Just because we can. Hey, Musketeer is solid in every meta. And then we have three books on her. I do have a soft spot for the Mini P.E.K.K.A. I think we could max out. I'm going to use the book on the Mini P.E.K.K.A. Because it's going to be level 14. If we had the gold, we could actually max out. And just like that, we're out of gold. I have enough to upgrade a minion. I'm surprised these didn't come with any gold offers. These, those offers were bad. You, bu you buy all the offers and you're still stuck with 50,000 wild cards and you can't spend them. I even dumped a lot of them into these cards. So I don't know if it counts the cards I already have. Oh, no, it does. 3,400 out of 1,500. So we still need 67,000 commons, 36,000 rares, 3,000 epics. We're pretty close to maxed out. W with the books and everything, that's... That's doable. Oh, this doesn't count the elite wild cards. Because I have like seven wild cards for the champion. So this should actually say 11. So with everything I have with the books, the 32,000 commons, the 20,000 rares, the 2,000 epics, I'm pretty much 95% maxed out minus the gold. Were those offers worth it? No, just, just honestly just stick to the diamond pass and buy the evolution that you think you're going to use. And always buy the book in the season shop. Well, let's make a deck based on levels now. Call me crazy, but I didn't have enough gold to max out the decks. So uh, we're we're going quadruple evolution, mortar bait, spell cycle. Oh, God, we're level 55. All right. One roll recruit shard. That's trash. They have level 13 princess. Why didn't they level it up? Oh, those level 15 goblins are going to cause a lot of struggles on them. My level 15 cards actually feel so good right now. I This is such a janky deck. I reckon they're not going to have Skarmy. Wait, they did have Skarmy. Okay, that's fine. How about a level 16 barrel with Ice Spirit? Dang it. <laughs> level 16 barrel. I love it. I'm all for it. They're going to have to fireball that. And we have Evolution Mortar. It's not even double elixir. Oh, Jesus. No, we don't let them connect. We have level 15 Princess Towers. We're mirroring it. That's so deadly. Wait, I want to see what Zap does to that. All right, Zap just wrecks it, decimates them. I'm all for that. They couldn't even get through. I think it's the level 16 goblin barrel. That's just insane. Okay, we need to add one card. I don't need ice spirit and skeletons. Dark goblin or goblin gang? Why not both? This is my last elite wild card. And I think I actually want hmm, Evo skeletons. We paid a win so hard and we didn't even build a proper deck. I'm dumb. <laughs> it works though. It's so paid to win that it, it works. Also that. Wizard's getting wrecked by my mortar. They're struggling so hard. Kind of wish I had a tank for this. Hmm. Skeletons versus Valkyrie. Anything I put down, they can't do. Everything's level 15. I might even put down a level 16 mortar. That's just to distract the the Bola Snare so the Dark Goblin doesn't die. It actually worked out really well. I think I need an Ice Golem. Or like something Thickums to tank. Knight. An Evolution Knight. I messed up. Why didn't I evolve a Knight? I mean, I already have an Evolved Knight. I just don't have the gold to, to get him up. Oh well. Oh, the boohoo emote's not in the amount in the shop. It should have been in the shop for 30 days. They would have made millions.
Gotta distract Ram Rider so Dark Goblin can do Dark Goblin things. <laughs> oh my god. They had a level 14 Electro Giant. Here's the neat thing. Mortar can defend against Electro Giant really well because it doesn't shoot against Electro Giant. Not within range. Come on, evil skeletons. Do your skeleton things. Beautiful. Oh. I need a knight. I need a knight. I'm going to figure out how to get a level 15 knight right now. I goofed up. I can't. I don't have enough. That would... If I were to get a level 15 knight, it would cost me as much as all the 20x value offers. It would probably cost me $500 with, without this elite wild purchase. Dang it. We're getting him to level 12. Maybe level 13. That's so cool. 3,000 gems. That's like net 3,000 gems is $50. That that's negative 5x value. Oh, we could boost him. Only last one hour, but... What happened to these potions? They just disappeared from the game. We're boosting. They need to they need to make the potions available in the shop and the season shop, and they need to make the boost 24 hours. W one hour sessions are so dumb. Also, what else is dumb is that my plus three zap is going to disintegrate them. What in the world is going on there? He survives the log. He survives the log. I too would be pissed. I, I get it. Skeletons to tank for the bats to end their misery. <laughs> I wish I could end this faster, sir. I don't have the DPS. I only have the levels. You know they're extra pay to win too because they have the free igloo skin from a couple years ago. That's so sad. I'm so sorry. This is this is a solid deck. I ended up just building mortar bait by accident. Oh wait. This is what we needed. Now we have the keys. The precious keys. Oh my precious. Gold. More gold. Oh! Mr. Level 15 King Tower. Alright there, pal. Alright. The level 14 Sparky. Nah, there's no way. We're not letting that Sparky connect. That's not even an evolved knight yet. And the level 14 bats don't die. That's so beautiful. That evolved knight is still way too tanky. Level 15 musketeer. I, I like their tenacity. I'm going to shut down their hopes and dreams right now. That evolved knight is... Tanking way longer than it needs to. He was struggling to defend. He wasn't even defending. He was just surviving. Why did they have... Such high level recruits. This is an absolute prison. Level 12 prince. Stupid prince. <laughs> no, that's, that's it. Goblin barrel, and that's a banger. He saved my dark goblin. He goofed up. Nah, they can't defend this mortar now. We're keeping that mortar fully alive just to BM them. Once I'm at 10 elixir, I'm going to do mortar, evil knight in the pocket. Oh god, no, I can't do that. You know what? I'm still going to do that. The bats are going to defend very well. You can't defend an evil knight, you fool! Nope, 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 nope! And then seven elite wild cards. That's a fully maxed out deck. You don't even need to spend a thousand dollars on this, you just need to spend 80. <laughs>